Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing some more Spyro 3 Year of the Dragon. Last time we came back here to Sunrise Spring and we did Sergeant Bird's part of Molten Crater. So Molten Crater is now at 100%. Uh, but as you can see, the only thing we've done in Midday, Mid uh, in Midday Gardens so far is the Sergeant Bird's base section, so that we have access to Sergeant Bird. So that's that done. Um, I noticed when we came back here that the Sparks Challenge over here is now unlocked. I have no idea what that's about, but let's go have a look. to reach it. There's a small hole that leads to a crawdad farm. I can take him there if he's ready. Uh, sure. Crawdad farm bonus world. Um. The adventure continues. It sure does. <laughs> um, I would have done this in the previous video if I knew it would be real short, but I don't know how long it's going to be. It might be really hard. Before you take on those nasty crawdads, I should give you some help. To start, let's practice shooting. Press the attack button to shoot these targets. Okay. So, oh, okay, so it's a, it's like a top-down shooter sort of thing? And I have a health bar? Okay. You can also move quickly by pressing the charge button. Can I smash through enemies when I charge into them? Or does that not work? Yep, looks like it. Okay. Now for the hard part. Being a maneuverable dragonfly, you can also strafe in any direction. Oh cool. Strafe, hold down the roll left or roll right button. Then move Spox's design looks kinda extra gross this close up. This like it's not very cute. It is it is unpleasant. <laughs> uh Okay, so I hold the Y button and... No, not the Y button, the L button. And then I don't turn uh, when I move the stick. Cool. Yeah, that's easy. Okay, so there's a top-down shmup part of this game. Okay, power-up butterfly. Okay. So, I'm just gonna eat this butterfly. What does it do? Oh, it gives me like a rapid fire sort of thing. It's not time limited though, it's actually like usage limited. Even though it showed up as time limited. I guess these are the crawdads. Looks like you're ready, Sparks. If you Okay, so Sparks is playable in this game. That is kinda neat. Uh let's have a look. Crawdad farm. Take Sparks to the farm. Sparks. Alright. So holding Y just makes you go faster in this game, which is kind of strange because holding Y normally makes you charge forward uncontrollably and kill things. Um, like it's completely different from the way playing as Spyro works. You don't lose any maneuverability, for example. Oh, B button, not, not X button. Oh, okay, you, I'm facing straight ahead, but Sparks automatically goes back and forth very annoyingly. Oh, oh, rockets, okay. Can I break the force field with the rockets or do something else? Green key. Oh, I see. Then I can go to the green door because I have the green key. Okay. I see what we're doing here. 
<laughs> this is weird. <laughs> okay, then go over here. Oh! Oh, a shield! Does that mean I can pierce the other shield, or does it not work that way? It doesn't look like I can get through. Hmm. So that was kind of wasteful. Uh. Oh dear. Very difficult, by the way. Red? Uh, what is that? I have nine of it, but I don't know what it is. Oh, they're like bouncy shots. They just go everywhere. That's kind of neat. Piercing shots, maybe? I'm not really sure exactly what it is they do, but it is stronger than a regular shot, so that's probably all that matters. Uh, hello. You were quite large. It's pretty tricky to move at full speed while strafing and shooting because you have to hold Y and you have to press A and I don't think they thought these controls through all the way. Oh, uh, I guess that was the final boss? Okay. <laughs> I guess that, that, that'd be the exit, but I don't want to go until I've got everything, so let's just keep looking around a little bit more. Alright, I haven't got a treasure detector because I'm playing as Sparks, who normally is the treasure detector. So I'm just going to need to look around manually, I suppose. How close am I? Uh, very close, very close. Let's just backtrack a little bit and see what I might have missed. I, I bet it's that spawner in the middle. Because I switched off the force field, right? Yeah. Wait, are there just a bunch of them stacked up? Oh wow, that's, that's really funny. Okay, there we go. That's all the treasure. So yeah, um... This game has shmup levels where you play as Sparks. And the controls are still not very good. <laughs> if it was like just hold hold the button in order to strafe and you kept your full like movement speed, maybe, but you can't actually strafe and go fast at the same time. Doesn't work. <sighs> Sure does. Okay, um, well that was an interesting little aside there. Um, it didn't take as long as I might have thought. Um, if I'd known it had been, you know, roughly that long, then maybe I would have put it in the previous video, but we can probably just jump ahead and do the next thing now. Uh, should be fine. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, it might be one of those one more level situations that messes me up. You've beaten the Crawdad King and found the lost egg. Not only that, oh, hello. Some of the dragon magic seems to have rubbed off on you. That sounds well, good. You can pick up gems when they're even further away from Oh my gosh, that's great. Oh wow, Sparks tasks are extremely worth doing. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, let's jump in here and make our way back to the gardens and proceed. I would assume the one in Midday Gardens can only be done once the world is finished, because that's how the one in Sunrise Spring worked, but we'll see how we go. Anyway, back to Midday Gardens. I wish you could do something on the 
a balloon screen, shoot flame or something, make it a bit more interesting. Okay, so last time we were here we did Sergeant Bird's base. Uh, we haven't been into any of the other levels yet. And there are quite a few around, so there's plenty of stuff to look at. Uh, let me see, what, what's a good spot to start? I don't really know what order you're intended to do things in. I know it doesn't usually matter, but it might be nice if we can figure out where they're expecting us to go. Spooky Swamp? Like Hunter's over there, let's not go that way. That dude's just annoying. Bamboo Terrace. Uh, country. Oh, that's the speedway. No thanks. Uh, and yeah, Sparks isn't. This isn't unlocked yet. I assume that unlocks once we finish the world, but we haven't done that yet. Uh, the closest one to the entrance, I think, is Enchanted Towers, but you have to do a mini game to open it. But eh, let's go in and have a quick look. Entering Enchanted Towers. Ba -ba -da. That's right, let's barrel roll. Let's continue to barrel roll. I love it. How are my sunglasses staying on? Like, I don't have ears <laughs> for, the, for the little, like, legs to sit on. Oh, look how far they can get the gems from. Oh, my goodness. Those crummy Rhinox forced us to build a statue of the sorceress. Then after we built it, she complained it was too ugly. <laughs> if you ask me, the statue is far prettier than she is. Not sure I like that joke. Not 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 sure I'm a big fan of the I guess casual misogyny. Hmm. I'm aware she's the villain, but hmm. 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 Actually, and yeah, getting that Sparks upgrade was real good. Uh but yeah. Hmm. I guess I need to spit rocks at that guy because he's flying. And for some reason I can't shoot into the air with any of my normal abilities. Oh, I can just do that. <laughs> hmm, I can see a bunch of stuff up there, but maybe we'll be coming back later in order to get that stuff? I don't really know. I'll try spinning a rock. Yeah, it doesn't go high enough. But we'll need to come like around. I'll assume I'll assume we'll get some more height later. God, collecting gems at a greater distance is an amazing upgrade. Like it's absurd how good that is. <laughs> uh, can we get on here? Uh, yes, does that help us though? Uh, I don't think so. I'm not quite sure how we get up to that higher ledge, but it'll happen, I assume. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh no! I thought I could walk along there, but you can't, apparently. <sighs> That's okay. Reigniting, folks. Reigniting. <sighs> okay, oh yeah, there's a save point right here, so it doesn't make a big difference, it's just I lost a life. And lives don't mean anything, so it doesn't really matter too much. I don't understand why they kept the lives in this game when they remade it. Hello, Gladys. 
Oh, you're cute. Oh. What a cute dragon. Uh. Ow. Much like Spyro 2, there's a lot of like, I guess they're roughly equivalent to orb quests, the things for getting all the little dragon eggs, but I think they're more fun. I think they've been designed a bit better than the ones in Spyro 2. Um, not, th this game's not perfect, it has problems, but that part I think is a bit better. Oh god. Uh, some of this platforming though, I don't know about this platforming. <laughs> That's that's not great. That's a bit of a problem. Um, also, don't really get why there's a reigniting loading screen every time you die. There shouldn't need to be. It's loading the same level you were already in. It shouldn't need to reset anything. It should basically just put you back here. <sighs> The original game, like, it had loading screens between levels, but it did not have a loading screen when you died. Uh, and that made sense to me. By the original game, I mean Spyro on, like, the PS1. All of the games in this collection have roughly the same problems. I mean, some of the same problems, but some of the same problems introduced by the remake, is my point. Okay, yeah, you meant to do that, and then get that guy out of the way, and then fly over here. Kind of wish there was, a, like, a ledge down there or something, so that if you didn't realize you were supposed to spit an egg, spit a rock at him you wouldn't you wouldn't just die but yeah I, I kind of get where they're coming from I guess okay so then I'm supposed to glide over to there where the statue is oh hang on what's this oh nearly escaped my notice sneaky sneaky back platform <laughs> okay uh, we head this way Glide, 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 do a little flutter. There we go. There's a rocket there. Oh, it blew up part of the statue. Interesting. Uh, yes, I want those gems. Look at the distance you can get them from now. And I assume that'll keep upgrading as I get the other ones. Oh, wow, that's just beautiful. Did you see that? Oh, music to my ears. Uh, I'm guessing I need to destroy, like, the statue completely before going up here does much. Uh, those guys are annoying. I'm almost ready to reveal my latest piece of real-time four-dimensional performance art. I call it... Hideous exploding witch number nine. Now, if you can just light the three rockets around here, my masterpiece will be complete. Sounds like it's my masterpiece because I'm the one doing the work. <laughs> um, let's just hop up here. Third rocket. There we go. And that'll destroy the third half of the witch. There we go. Oh, and there's a passage below. <laughs> I forgot I hit this egg inside the statue. I hope the explosion didn't hard boil it. God, I hope so too. Peanut? Hi, Peanut. Oh, you're chasing your tail. Oh, adorable. Okay, uh, now these guys. I think what we got to do is get up on the ledge here where the, the statue was. Uh, and then we should be able to hit him, right? Come on, how did that miss? <sighs> We're supposed to actually find a rock and spit it at them, but that's just so annoying. Especially when I can't see any rocks around. Did they just respawn? Ugh, I hope not. Okay, I'm just gonna keep going and just ignore them for now. Okay, so you want to go down this hole, I assume. Yeah, and that leads to a twirly whirly. Okay. Oh, I'm still me. Oh, is this into the skate park? Oh, I forgot there was one of these in the first world. 
Why are there skate parks? It's so silly. Had like a Tony Hawk game just come out and they thought, oh, this is so cool, we need to do the same thing. Is that, is that like the origin of the skate parks in Spyro 3? Because, <laughs> I mean, they're so silly. <sighs> oh, oops. The extra gem range is really helping out here. I'm so glad I got that upgrade. Uh, that is a death pit. No, it's not. It's it's a half pipe. Let's go. <laughs> half pipe's much more fun. I wonder why Spyro doesn't have like a helmet. Because like Hunter does, and it seems like encouraging. You know, bad uh, skateboarding safety is not a good idea for a game targeted at kids. I don't know. <sighs> is there a way to actually get off the skateboard? Doesn't seem to be. I'm trying to talk to Hunter, but it won't let me. Probably knows that I don't like him. It's it's protecting me from having to talk to him. I wonder why there isn't like a point system. There we go. Okay, well, um, now I can go talk to Hunter. What's up, Hunter? Can I talk to him? This there we go. The wildest skateboard park you've ever seen? Once you've mastered a few tr sure, I'll learn some tricks. Easy. You can jump off the end of ramps by pressing the jump. I think we've done this already, haven't we? Didn't we do this in World 1? Try doing a roll. You can, roll. can I do it wrong? Okay. Uh, X button. Hey, nice roll. Now let's see you pull. Okay, I don't really need to see you do all this stuff. Like I did this in the previous skateboard park. I just need to go past here and get the egg or whatever. Probably an egg. Oh, you must be a natural. Now let's see if huh. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Wait, it didn't interrupt me, I can just keep going? Huh. See if you can do a 900. Get I think that's what I just did. I don't know how much I need to spin. <laughs> One, two. Oh. Not enough. Oh my god. One, two. One, two. There we go. Now that was a 900. I have to admit, you've got. Okay, 500 points. Alright.
Huh? All right. What? What am I doing wrong? How do I continue? It's just walking me back here every time I do anything. <laughs> That was a double roll. Ugh, transmisogyny. What? <laughs> no? That wasn't good enough? Well, excuse me, princess. That was a double roll. <sighs> Is that enough points? Okay. Speaking of which, I was just practicing this nearly impossible. This is very annoying. <laughs> Remember, I was talking about how not annoying these these egg, egg quests are. This one is annoying. Okay, I made that up, but you can still have this egg. Carolyn, sweet portal two reference, bro. Is there more to do here, or am I done? Trick skater two. Oh no, there's more. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I'm getting points already, and Hunter isn't. So that's helpful. I think I'm a lot better at this. <laughs> Oh, come on. <sighs> I don't understand how the scoring works here. Looks like I'm getting less points for doing this than I was before. <sighs> I guess I need to do something different, but I don't really know what, because there's barely any tricks in this game. Clearly a triple roll. Come on. <sighs> I don't enjoy this very much. How come if you jump you can't do anything? Doesn't well, make sense. There's no shame. Right. Uh, fine. There isn't a restart button. I was trying to. Uh, what? Oh. 
Right, if you, if you jump, you're not allowed to do a roll afterwards for some reason. I didn't get it. I'm not having fun. <sighs> Just giving him way more points for doing the same things. That was clearly a triple. For some reason it doesn't count the first one or something? I don't know. <sighs> Why is this in the game? It's not good. It's, it's, just, it's just bad and not fun. <sighs> and I hate it. And it's bad. You can't do real combos, like in Tony Hawk, for example, you could do like a manual or something or a grind to keep the combo going and chain more tricks, but you can't do that here. Because none of those things exist in this game. Unlike a real skateboarding game, which is sometimes fun to play. <laughs> uh... Clearly a triple backflip. Mm. I assume you're supposed to mix up which tricks you're using, but it doesn't really seem to take that into account much. And there's only like three types of tricks in the game. There's not a whole lot you can do to mix it up. Mm. Also, it's completely unintuitive whether you're going to do the half pipe thing or not. Like, it's just completely random. Also, the amount of points it's worth is completely random, as far as I can tell. Well, there's no shit. Just come find me. I'm just gonna go grab the other treasure that's in this room, and then I'm gonna kill the hunter. I'm gonna, gonna kill him. He's gonna be dead. This is just a really, really bad skateboarding game. It's not what I was trying to do. Ugh. Whatever, I'll just, I'll just do it without a skateboard. I can, I can probably do it without. No, I can't. No, no, Spyro is incapable of standing on a ramp for some reason. Even though in the first game you can supercharge down these massive ramps and it's the coolest thing ever. Um, uh, that's way further than I was intending to fly, but okay. I just want to get up there and get that. I don't really know how to do that, though. Because I keep jumping way too far. And there's, like, no control over anything. And I hate it. <sighs> some treasure. I like treasure. Just go on foot. Uh, come on. 
Come on, we can get close enough. We can get close enough without using that goddamn skateboard. No, we can't. Can we get a skateboard up here somewhere? Yes, we can just grab one here and then go over there. a lot more fun in Spyro 1 when it was just supercharging. That worked a lot better. Like, it was really hard, but it, it was better. <laughs> uh, I just, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like these, these skateboard minigames, and I assume they're only going to get more and more infuriating. Because the ones in this area are much more complicated than the ones in the previous area. Stop, 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 go back! <sighs> okay, hang on. How are you supposed to reach that? I what, whatever I do, I'm just going way too far. If I come up, like, right, right where it is, like this sort of side. Oh, there's no way to break, by the way, unlike in a real skateboarding game. You just go forward at the same speed all the time. <sighs> Okay, I got it. I think that's all the treasure in this area. Oh, sparks can't spin because I'm on a skateboard. Great. Let me just crash into a wall. There we go. Yeah, sparks are telling me to leave, which probably means there's no more treasure in here. Um, okay, I'm gonna go get the rest of the stuff in this level, and then maybe I'll come back and finish the horrible skateboarding minigame. Maybe. I might not. All right, these guys. Okay, finally got that one. That's a start. Um, let me see. Can I climb on this? Doesn't look like it. It's just decorative. I can see, like, another side area way over there, but I don't know how I'd reach that. The trolley whirly here doesn't get you high enough, right? Let me just check. Whirly, 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 whirly. Yeah, it doesn't. It stops basically where the ledge begins, so I need to go somewhere different. Um, oh, here's another twirly whirly. There we go. That'll get me some height. Uh, then I can use that to go over here, where this fellow is. I'm not sure if that was a bad person or if I just defeated someone I wasn't supposed to. I had a bone. I guess I, guess I was trying to get the bone. I mean, it seems like they should be able to keep their bone. I haven't really done anything to deserve it. And no one's asked me to take it or anything. Can I just jump to that? Yes. Can I twirly whirly with this in my mouth? Yes. Uh, it takes me all the way over here, but that's okay, that'll work. Uh, probably gonna stop playing after this video, just because I'm getting frustrated. I'll come back later, of course, I'm just saying for now. Hey, nerd. Oh, I missed. Well, um... Oh well. <sighs> I assume there's something else I'm supposed to do that's less ridiculous in order to get uh, projectiles to hit those guys. Don't know what, though. Mm. Oh, hang on, is that a door? Can I, can I get up there? Yeah, I can get up there. Okay. Hello. Does that help me at all? I'm going to the bone, but I still don't know why I would want that. This level's design is very confusing. It's 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 extremely unclear what I'm trying to achieve. Uh, 
Also, these guys are the worst. <sighs> well, I got that one. That's something. I guess I want to glide over there. I can probably reach that. Uh, maybe. Yes. Okay. God, these guys are obnoxious. doing? Still one left? Alright. It's up way too high now. <sighs> oh gosh, there's a whole bunch of other side areas. What do we have here? with my pet wolf Farley but I accidentally threw his ball down this hole and he went in after it now he's okay I'll, I'll save you wolf I can do that uh, I like wolves let's go oh he's adorable oh 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 game redeemed this is a good game again oh, I'm playing fetch with a little wolf <laughs> yes Yes, that's what I'm doing. Let's go. Oh, I see. I need to stand on this thing, right? Hey, Farley, come here. Give me your ball. Good boy. Now I need to put it on this button, right? Oop, oh, nope. No, that's spattered all the way over there for some reason. How do I put it where I want it? Oh, like that. And then he'll stand there, and I can go with the switch. Okay. Bip. Oh, his enemies in there. Watch out, little wolfie. Frame rate. There's too much stuff in this area. <laughs> oh, gosh. It seems like the puppy isn't really affected by the enemies at all. He's just sort of standing there and going, hey. Hey puppy, how about you stand on this button for me? Good little puppy. Pretty sure we could just glide across there. Oh, I see, I see. Hang on. Come here puppy. Go get your ball. I meant to do that, and then I can glide across. I see. One of those puzzles. You know the ones. Okay, what does this button do? It lowers that. Interesting. Okay. Uh, come here, puppy. What I want you to do is go stand over there. On on the button? Yeah, good. Good puppy. Then I go over here. And I glide onto the platform. Oop. Press the wrong button and I don't flutter. Okay, uh, this is a long video, wow. Uh, I think I chose the wrong one more level. Uh, okay. Hang on. Puppy? You gotta move from that spot? I need you to not be there so I can get onto the other platform. Missing something here. There we go. Figured it out. <laughs> okay, um. Can I just go over here and glide over there and we can continue? 
Hey, puppy. This is where we started. We did it. We saved your puppy. You found barley. How can I ever thank you? Do you have an egg? I could give you this old egg, but Farley's been chewing on it and it's kind of slimy. Ooh. Oh, well, it's the thought that counts, right? Yeah, yeah totally. List. All right. Oh, cute. Okay, that area was good. Um See, that's the way you should design your egg quests. You make them fun. <laughs> Rescue the Lost Wolf was super fun. The skating was terrible. Um, basically, make your like quest like, side quests and stuff be based on regular platforming, and then they'll be fun. But if they're based on, you know, weird crap, they won't be fun. Uh, can I stand on that? No, it looks like a platform. <sighs> This level's design has some problems. <laughs> oh gosh. Reigniting. 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 Okay, we're back. Um, uh, let me see. Okay, so we're done in there. Let's try going over here and see what this is about. This is one of the like players and other character cages, so I'm ready to patrol the towers and the perimeter of the islands whenever you want me to. Uh yeah, let's to be back. Let's go, Sergeant Bird. I guess I'm playing as you now. Uh it's telling me about the dinosaur bones again, so maybe there's some bones in this room? I don't know. Oh, oh yes. Rocket's good against those guys. <laughs> That's exciting. Oh, what's up here? Oh, I see. Oh, hang on, are we in the same area? We are, this is the same place. We're just playing as the other guy. Oh, okay, instead of giving him his own sub area, you just switch characters and then you can play as him and do the stuff he's capable of. Oh, that is that is really good. Oh, wow, that, that's super helpful. And that's how you're supposed to get in there. You're not really supposed to bring Spyro over. Oh, okay, okay. And just kill that guy. I don't know what these bones are for, but we've got half of them, so... Wait, we're doing good. <laughs> okay, okay. This is actually vastly superior to every previous character switch. <laughs> it's just, hey, you know how you're playing a Spyro? Well, now you're not. And you're still in the same place, so... You can deal with all the crap that Spyro couldn't in the same place. It's very good to me. I enjoy being able to deal with crap. Oh my gosh. Can I break that big door open? Is that something I'm supposed to be doing? No, that was the door to um the room with Farley in it. The little puppy. Uh, and I guess uh, I'm not allowed to go there now. Since I'm not playing as Spyro and only Spyro is allowed to rescue puppies. That's how it works, right? Okay, and then we can just go exploring the whole level with flight in order to find everything that we may have missed earlier. Can I break that open? My cannon? Looks like no, but I'm, maybe I can. Hang on. If I fly up a bit... Looks like no, we might need to actually bring Spyro over here, which we can do, uh, in order to get that one. Which I'd forgotten about. Okay, so I assume getting all these bones will get us an egg, but I don't really know why. <laughs> it's just something I'm doing. Uh, we already brought Spyro over here earlier, so I don't need to worry about that. How are we doing? Oh, we are going well. Okay.
Flappy flap flap. There's something way up here. Oh, looks like there is. What do we got? It's like a little ledge here. Is there any treasure up here, or is it just like you can technically go up here? If you want to. That's as high as it goes. Doesn't seem like there's anything up here though, which is kind of weird. Uh... Give me your bone, fool. <laughs> This is where the game level started, I think. Roughly here, anyway. Oh, no, it was over there. Was it? I don't remember. I think the last of the treasure is now in that bit only Spyro can open. Oh no, I can see another, uh, whatchamacallit. Here, have this. I was going to keep it as a souvenir, but I don't have room in my luggage. Is it an egg? It's Ralph! Hi, Ralph. Oh, we've rebuilt the skeleton guy like in the previous game. Okay. Okay. There he goes. I don't think I could skip that, by the way. <laughs> um... How much is left? 482. Hmm. There may be a bit more that I need to get with this guy. I'm not sure. Let's have another quick look around, see if we can spot anything. The last piece we need Spyro again so we can head bonk. Uh, but we may be able to grab something before that if there's like a flying enemy or something we need to hit. I don't think there is though. And Sparks is only circling in that one direction. I don't know if Sparks can circle multiple ways, if there's multiple spots that have treasure, or... Um, I saw a Twirly Whirly over there. Is there something down there? No? Did I imagine a Twirly Whirly? Oh, it's coming off of his little sta staff there. I see. Okay. Okay, I think we're done with Sergeant Bird, so let's grab Spyro again. If you can know I'm off duty and that puts him off duty? That's kind of a weird use of words, but okay. <laughs> okay, we can glide back over here. Whirly whirly our way up to here. And we glide over here. And we don't fall off, hopefully. Okay, and then we can get whatever is in that chest, and hopefully that's the last of it. Looks like quite a bit. Yes! Okay. Uh, so if you have a look at what we've done now, we've done everything except Trick, Sta Trick Skater 2. I don't want to keep this video going for any longer in order to try to do that, so I'm gonna call it here and. I guess I'm gonna do that separately because it's so annoying. Uh, <laughs> Let's ch chuck down a save. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I enjoyed most of this level. I did not like the skateboarding segment because it wasn't a good skateboarding segment. It was very bad. It was very terrible design. Um, let this be a lesson to you all. Don't put bad skateboarding segments in your platformers. If you want to put a good skateboarding segment in your platformer, that's fine. Just make sure it's good. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye!